It's December. It was snowing earlier today. It was sleeting. And I'm in my workshop, which is not heated or air conditioned. Of course, I don't care about air conditioning right now. But anyway, I bought this uh, 10 to 30,000 butane heater from Mr. Heater. They got Amazon. And I'm going to hook it up real quick. It doesn't look like it's too hard. Hopefully, we're going to see how well this thing works. So it looks like instruction manual. And it looks like it's just a bracket that kind of probably sits on this thing. So looks like it's probably going to mount on here somehow like this or like that. I don't know. I'll look at the instructions in a minute. Obviously, this is threading onto here, it looks like. Locking in place. Pull the fingers out. Uh, let's see, it's supposed to come loose in shipping here. We'll snap that on and get it down in here. Let's take a look at this real quick. Let me see. All right. So, yeah, so basically, that's going to mount to that. There's two holes there. And it looks like there's some threaded screws that I need to fit on there. So let me see what I got in the bag here and hook this up real quick. All right, it was just two screws to mount this onto the bracket and then tighten this one bracket up. That was all it is. So let me go ahead and open the, the valve. Try to light this thing. Brand new. It's never been used before. So we're going to turn this on to low to medium. And we're going to start on this guy over here. I'm supposed to hold that in for about 30 seconds. Let things get warmed up there. Feeling some heat already. I didn't wait 30 seconds, I was able to let it out and get this other one lit up. If you run one burner, of course, you're only getting half the wattage. I didn't have to wait 30 seconds on that one either. All right, these guys are running. So we're gonna let them run a little bit. My daughter's got a little project she's gonna do out here in the workshop, and uh, we're gonna let them run, see if it warms this place up a little bit, because it's cold right now, it's like 35 degrees. So we'll see what they do. All right, so I had it running for about, I don't know, 10 minutes or so while my daughter was doing a craft out here. The, this barn is like 24 by 32. I do have insulation around most of the sides, but no insulation up top. But it is warming it up a little bit to my point when my daughter took her jacket off. So I think, I think this will be a good addition. I mean, it's still not like take everything off and just go and come out here in shorts or anything like that. But it is 35 degrees when we got out here. And so uh, it's definitely significantly warmed up the area. So I think this will be a good addition to my shop and at least taking the cold, the edge of the cold off anyway if I can you know, work through the winter in these cold days out here. So I'm going to run a few more times before I, before I make a final assessment on it, make sure it continues to start easy for me and, and runs well and uh, all that kind of stuff, see how well it holds up. So again, this is the, uh, the Mr. Heater 10,000 to 30,000 BTU heating unit. Just that's on the propane tank there. and getting a little too hot to stand this close to it. So. Anyway, we'll see how it goes. Right, I would tell you, I got this last year, and my barn is 24 by 32, I believe it is. It's not completely finished as far as drywall everywhere and everything. So open ceiling gets really hot in here, also gets really cold in here. And I put an air conditioner last year, which was really great for the summer. But I didn't have a get a heater unit on it. And so I tried the Mr. Heater, and most of the clip was from last year when I got it, set up and everything. Uh, this year too, thing starts up right off the bat. This thing is nice. I really highly recommend this if you want to just go with a cheap solution. I don't know how long it takes to burn through this tank, but I've I run this when I come out here in the cold winter here and use it. And man, I'm telling you, it's not like it's not like it's going to make the whole barn super warm. But it's January. Uh, actually, no, it's February. It's February first today. In upstate South Carolina. It is cold outside, and here I am in a t-shirt. I'm actually doing some woodworking working out and stuff like that, but this thing warms it up good enough to come out here and do stuff. So this thing, I highly recommend it. I'm very happy with this product. So give me a like, give me a subscribe. Thank you.